Furman University is a beautiful college campus that provides many different outlets for exercise and physical activity to students, staff, and faculty members. When looking at the campus as a whole, the first stop for physical activity is usually the Physical Activity Center, otherwise known as the PAC. The PAC provides members of the community with exercise machines and weights. It also has its group exercise classes such as yoga and Zumba, and intramural sports such as indoor soccer and basketball. Near the PAC are the sand volleyball courts located on E-Field. These courts are a great venue for events such as sorority fundraisers or a place just to get to know students that live nearby. One of the most popular locations for physical activity on campus is the Swamp Rabbit Trail, located behind the Furman Lake. On this trail, people choose to do activities such as biking, walking, and jogging. My favorite place to work out on campus would probably be the Swamp Rabbit Trail. I love working out outside a lot better than inside. Um, it just gets my mind off of school and I get outside of the Furman bubble. The Swamp Rabbit Trail was created roughly around 2007-2008 when it became an actual trail. It's named after the Swamp Rabbit Rail Line, which has been around for, for a long time. Um, the Greenville County Economic Development Committee purchased the rights to the trail, and that's really when it turned into a rail-to-trail effort. Uh, trails are the most popular recreational facility identified in the, in the literature across the country and has a tremendous impact on, on health, but also on environmental sustainability and, and more active transportation, people using their bodies to get from point A to point B. So the trails had a tremendous impact on Greenville and it's one of the most popular amenities in Greenville. If you look at the Convention Visitors Bureau data that they put out and brochures, it's, it's come to Greenville and get on the trail. Well, I definitely think students are aware of the trail for sure. And I think a lot of them use the trail for physical activity. We have uh, evidence through our direct observation and intercept surveys that students are using it for physical activity. So I think it's definitely had an impact on overall physical activity opportunities for students. I think we need to do a little bit better job of awareness among when freshmen come to campus. Freshman year, I found out about the Swap Rabbit. Um, with, I was with a bunch of friends running and we used to just run all around campus and one day we saw a sign that um, said Swamp Rabbit Trail and a long paved road, so we just tried it out, and now I don't run anywhere else. Well, I used to be on the cross-country and track team, and so the team would use it for long runs sometimes or for workouts if we were doing intervals. It's really cool because there's mile markers, so we could use it to do mile repeats or keep track of our times more easily. I think it's really cool and really unique that Furman has that on campus. And I love the surface. It's great for running. Um, it's really different from a treadmill or just being inside the pack. Traveler's Rest is only 2.2 miles north of, uh, of our campus. And students, faculty, me included, will go up to TR either for coffee or food or just to go up and there's other errands that you can do actually with, within TR. There's Williams Hardware, uh, Leopard Forest, and then the Trailside Creamery, which has delicious ice cream that I love to get after a long run. And Williams Hardware also has bathrooms and water for any of the trail users, which is really cool too. I mean, a big part of the trail is active transportation. So not only is it close in proximity to Traveler's Rest, it is six miles to downtown Greenville, but on a bike, that's really not that far. My team also biked downtown one time. We had an off day and decided to bike the seven miles downtown. And um, we went down there for a festival. I think it was fall for Greenville. And so it's a really cool way to kind of get involved in the community and experience all that the community has to offer since you can so easily access things from there. The Swamp Rabbit Trail found in Furman's backyard has evolved into not only a platform for physical activity, but also a path for community outreach. Furman is a unique environment that constantly promotes physical activity and a healthy way of life.